Hello, my friends. My name is Vasily. I am a US engineer. One day I will start with, with, a, with a description of myself that I am just engineer, right? But today I am I'm trying to do different engineering things and this video is about that. So I am learning uh, Arduino, right? So, and it would be very interesting to try to learn together, right? Try different things, I mean, like, we have Let's Plays, right? And this is, would be Let's, Let's Arduino, Let's Program. Anyway, so, uh, what is the plan? Um, I have, actually, I can switch to another cam, right? And we will discuss our plan. So, if we are going here, right? So, I have a plan. So, look at this. I have many of such kits, right? This, this kit, uh, as I correctly remember, yeah, I have this schema. I bought, I bought it on, I think, one of the, I mean, website, uh, like AliExpress or something like this. So, um, this should be a like a schema that can play some music right but we we will double check double check it with our um chat gpt right so and uh, we will try to understand how to control it so what what is what is the main idea of this video right let me switch back and we will discuss it so yeah, I'm just checking that I'm here and it is it is good, it is recording, right. Okay, so what is the plan? Like, uh, we have here, like, um, some pins, right? If you look at this schema, right? Uh, anyway, I'm, uh, we will double check. So we have, we have this schema, but to control this schema, we need to send uh, from uh, five from four dot five up to five dot five volts, right? So this is like an Arduino task, of course. So we need to send these signals uh, to play one of the melody. So probably we have here like eight melodies. I think so. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, we have here eight melodies, right? And we will try to play it, but we will solder it in the, one of the next videos, right? But I want to be ready to test it. So, and what I wanted to do, I want just to have a device already prepared that, ca that could help us to test it, right? To test already soldered device. Mm -hmm. So, and that's what we are going to do, right? So, to do this, let me switch back to my wonderful um, desk, right? And here, actually, I, I can start with this and I can maybe just use my uh, desk cam, right? Without myself, you don't want to see me. Okay, so uh, what we're going to do, we, are, we have this Arduino, we have this board, right, like a breadboard where we can put everything. I also have this kit, I, I think this is from official Arduino kit, I, I think so, all of these things, right? So uh, probably uh, we, will, uh, we will test it on the um led right maybe we will take yellow or red or something like this right maybe we will because look at this schema right sorry this camera has only manual focus if i start moving and like if i zoom it it would be like i will spend a lot of time to return it back mm -hmm. so we 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 need to send these different signals right so like we have A, B, C, D, 
And where is where is this A B C D? Right? Let me show you on a schema on the board, right? So yeah. Here I think you can see this this row. This is A B C D. We can no 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 it uh, anyway I cannot focus on it, sorry. So and we will what we will do we will we will set up um, we will use this Arduino Nano we will use this board we will use probably um, these LEDs to understand that everything is working and also I am thinking about like why not I have I have lots of different lots of different schemas and this is Let's different devices, right? And this is, um, I suppose, I2C or how it's named. This board can help us easily connect this uh, screen, right? So maybe we will connect this screen and like just try to to look. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I'm looking at, at the screen, but I'm not looking at my um, computer, how I show it to you. <laughs> of course, it's not professional. So, I think this, this is our task, part of our task. And, yeah, let me return back so I can turn this off. Again, this video is not tutorial. Um, I, I'm, I do not have, like, a very strong... Um, background on, on Arduino, right? I did something before, I try, I know the concepts, but I didn't touch Arduino like many, many, many months, so maybe, maybe at least already one year. So, and it would be interesting, right, just to try to do something new, right? We, we, HD, we want to learn something new, we are brave, right? to learn something new, and that's what we are going to do today. So, I think we can start. Um, let me switch to my screen. I already created the project, right? So, I have Visual Studio. Yeah, this is our chat GPT. We will, we will return to it in a few moments. So, I use this platform I.O. I use this, uh, I don't know, platform, uh, framework, tool, I don't know how we can name it, right? So, um, to build and, and compile uh, our application, right, like firmware, I think it should be firmware, right? Uh, the, the software we are uploading on the, on the microchip, we can name it as a firmware, right? Sorry for my English. Yeah, I mean, you can hear that this is not the perfect. Okay, so, yes, I, I talked about this. I talked about this is not professional. I talked about I have, like, a, not a great experience. And this is not tutorial, so I don't want to burn your, your time. I just want to have fun. And I also, um, I, th I, oh my god, English is not working. <laughs> um, I hope... It, it would be like also interesting and lots of fun for you my wonderful 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 audience mm -hmm. friends so yeah uh let's start so first of all let's double check what do we know about this thing right like okay i can see my screen let's switch to chat gpt we will use gpt4 and we will talk we will talk to him about this schema i have a name of this schema so uh i i i will re repeat this each video so uh when ai will um, will uh conquer hold the world right i want to be friend with ai that it do not uh, do not force me to do lots of activities I mean physical activities so and this is like idea i am very polite with chat gpt and also we are good people right like we wanna we wanna make our chat gpt very polite so i'm always greeting chat gpt hello chat 
GPT, right? So uh, I have I have uh, TJ fifty six one twenty nine um, do it yourself kit kit soldering kit ring kit. Uh, do you know what is do you know what is that right so let's see sorry okay okay so I'm sorry but as my knowledge cut off September 21 I don't have any specific information on a do-it-yourself soldering kit named um okay okay but but maybe you know you know you know uh, okay Uh, circuits maybe uh, or board let's just double check sorry for conclusion okay okay so looks like we we do not know the answer I mean chat GPT do not know this answer but I already checked it oh you see like this is first time I prepared for our meeting right I I, I am wonderful yeah, regularly I am not preparing these videos, I have just idea, I just turn on the music, we are listening to the same music to, to be on a one wave, and um, I am not preparing for the videos, I, I just try to develop this thing, like try to, um, to get new skill when I can talk uh, live. Right, so this is kind of live conversation, right? But without audience, audience, right? And I'm, I already passed that time when I had to record billions of, um, billions of uh, times, right? When I have to repeat the same thing lots of times, and I'm okay with this. Uh, I mean that my videos they are not perfect, and this is good because. This is one of my problems because I'm a software engineer and I wanna wanna make uh, my code perfect. So yeah, this is kind of also you see we are all learning here. I hope so. So okay, uh, we do not know. Okay, let's jump to Arduino. This is uh, so okay, okay to control. Actually, let's let's go back. So we do not know uh, this chat chat GPT do not know the answer, right? So what we're going what we're going to do? We're going to go back, right? And we will go to the main file. Oh, actually, I have here two. What? What? Okay, can I? Show in Finder. Okay, this is weird, right? Visual Studio Code. Okay, so where is the main file, right? I mean, I just created it and I cannot see main dots. Oh, source, main CPP. Okay, we are here. Wonderful. So let's try uh, Arduino. Arduino. Chat GPT help us. Okay, I have a task. So okay, uh, that kit is an Arduino. Oh, no, 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 is uh, a music circuit. Uh, my English, so okay. Let's music board. <laughs> okay, and and word board. I okay. Is a music board. Uh, I need 
uh, Arduino to control it. I need Arduino to control it, right? Lots of mistakes. Mm -hmm. So, uh, how it should work? How? Uh, yeah, I, I, I even do not know how to type, right? <laughs> okay, so how should it work? Um, uh, it has four pins and ground and the ground I need to what I need so I need to send signals to a different pins so uh, when I okay when I send co a combination come combination um, when I send a combination of of signals when I send a combination of signals to these pins uh, it would play it will play uh, will play oh my god play oh like if it's too slow for you right yeah one way you can close the video right and say hey i will never return back to this wonderful guy or you can uh, try to increase speed of this video regular like one and half x time it's kind of okay right so it will play a different uh music so, for example, I send, uh, so, for example, I have pins A, B, A, B, C, D. I send sig signal, signal, <laughs> signal uh, that looks like a equal a equal one b equal zero c equal equal one d equal zero and melody melody would play is going to be played right Uh, can you help me to tell me to, to create Arduino? Can you write me? Can you can you help me to write this Arduino code for the let Form IO Visual Stu for platform IO platform or VS plugin. Okay, Arduino, right? Okay, let's let's see, let's see. Below an example. Uh, okay. So. First, we need to define. Okay, sure, I can help you with that below. Look, let's check. I mean, was I clear or not? Of course, right? Like I, I probably I, I made lots of mistakes. Of course, I know, I know. You will correct me. Thank you very much. Thank you. First, we need to define the pins that we are going to use. Let's assume we have connected the music port to the digital pins. Two, three, four, and five. Uh, the Arduino uh, and ground to the ground, right? We'll call these pins A, B, C, D, respective. Of course, right? And we have this one. Okay. Okay. Sounds sounds correct, right? So okay. 
let me do this thing. Okay. So uh, let me go. Let me go here to my board. Where is my board? Okay, we are here, right? We have loop, la la la, set up. So my function sets up loop. Okay. And what what do we need? We need to have it here, right? So we do not need this. We just have set up and loop, right? So let's do. Okay. So and I do not remember. Okay, digital right. Simply um, the code sets A and C to high, which is equivalent of one, and B and D to low. Uh, is that going uh, to send five volts to pins? I just don't remember, right? A and C. Okay, it keeps this state for 10 seconds, which I assume be enough for time the melody play. Adjust the delay time according to the length of your melody. If you want to play different melodies in a sequence, uh, you can start simply duplicate the digital right. Uh, okay, okay, okay. Let's ask one more question, right? Mm hmm. Yes, hi. Okay, typically around five volts, right? Some boards of voltage. Oh, yeah, I, I just remember we have on each Arduino, right? On each Arduino board, or regular, we have, we have um, multiple pins, right? Let me check. Yeah, we have five volts and we have three and three volts, right? This is different pins. Okay. Wonderful. So we can try to assemble. Okay. So, okay. Uh, what should I do if I want to test it? I want to uh, connect let me check. I want to connect uh, LED, LED to understand to understand what melody melody uh, should, what melody is playing. Uh, will it be will it be clear? Yeah, yeah. If you want to connect LED to visualize it, yes, that's what I thank you. I mean this this chat know me very well. We are friends, you you remember this, right? I said hello in the at the beginning of the video. So um you can connect L uh, LEDs to the same pins at the music board. The way uh, whenever a signal is sent to a pin, the corresponding um, LED will light up, right? Here's how you might set up. Connect the OK longer LED anode to each uh, LED to the digital pins 2, 3, 5, 2 3, 4, and 5 and are doing OK through resistor okay i need to get resistors right hope i can find them right i mean okay let's do this right so and uh, this is our code okay let's try i am going to switch to my desk Right, I'm going to, to do this one, oh, to enable the light. And right now, what can we do? Uh, 
we can try to make it work, right? Um, first of all, let me grab my Arduino, let unpack this new fresh breadboard, right? For you, everything, everything you, my, my friends because you are awesome so and for awesome people we will use only the best right so uh, we are going to do this right we just set up here actually okay 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 I think I mean I, I'm looking at the video I hope the quality is nice I hope so so yep so okay what do we have here we have here our pins our breadboard our arduino right now we need to um, we need to take some wires right for example black and and um black and and red oh my god um, okay, where is the black one? Okay, so uh, what I'm going to do? So I'm going. No, this is incorrect. Red. This one. All right. So first of all, I will take like a five volts. Not. F um, do I need to connect to have a, a common ground? No, I do not need to have a. Yeah, my ground maybe yes, maybe yes. So I need black, I need a black um, wire, right? Yeah, my English completely not working today. Okay, so uh, black wire. Where are you, my friend? Okay, I cannot find it. It would be blue. So blue would be our ground and we have g and d right and i'm going to set it to the here right okay so let me double check oh let me double check one two three four one two three four okay and then what we're going to do we need to to take like four leds let's do this we will have um, blue, yellow, green, and red, right? So these four guys. And right now we need to take, we need to find resistors, right? 220. Okay, 220. I mean, uh, 220 ohms, right? So... I have one of this wonderful device that could make my uh, life easier, right? This tester, right? Here you are. Oh, oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. This wonderful tester, all right? So I have these pins and I mean, and I can, um, I can try to find correct uh, resistor, right? For example, let me check what resistors do I have here. Actually, I think I have I have all kind of resistors. I just need to find them. Probably right now you can hear a lot of noise because my video is so professional. <laughs> so let me check. Um, if I want to check testing unknown part, okay, what about resistor? If I try to do this one, okay, this is resistor, okay, you know it. What about this guy? Okay, let's start, let's try again. Blue one. Um, mm, it's not connected. Okay. What? An unknown part. Is it? Is it? What if I put it here? A 
Okay, so 2,000. Oh, wait. Just 2 kilo ohm, right? But I need... Wait a moment. I need... How much? Let me switch back. Um, oh, I need just 220, 220 ohm, right? Just 220. Okay, let's try a different one, right? And try to understand, is it is it what we're looking for? 220 ohm. Okay, unknown parts. Maybe I... Maybe and that first was also incorrectly merged. Ma uh, merged. <laughs> I'm already. You see, I'm already merging. Um, actually, this is the same. 4K, for kilo ohm, kilo ohms, right? Okay, let's let's try a different one. Let's try this one. Yeah, Lee, yeah. One day I will I will learn. Oh. 220 ohms, right? That's what we need. We need four, four of these guys, right? So let me check. So I have, I have this one, um, and probably I have more, right? I have this, this set, and I'm trying to find where, where am I? Wonderful. Uh, resistors where are they so let me check probably this one is it 220 right okay is it 220 sorry i hope sorry for this yeah um yes 220 and this is 220 so probably more more of them also would be like a 220 but let's just double check to be sure that we are doing correct things right mm -hmm. okay 220 and also here let's do 220 right it should be 220 also right Okay. Let me return this back. Of course, unknown part because I'm using it incorrectly. Right. Okay. Wonderful. 220. So let's return back and try to make schema right so uh, i can switch back to my face right so we can turn off the slides right and so what do we need we right now oh this is incorrect mouse <laughs> so we have here our so it is going to be digital right digital digital output so okay double check the specification of your board some boards can can use different voltage right this information should be listed in the data sheet right so uh i have arduino nano so, okay the lo so connect the longer leg a node to the each led right to the, uh, of each led to the digital pins okay we have digital pins and we have long uh, led long <laughs> long leg <laughs> of a led okay okay so uh, let's go back here and we will try to do that thing right I mean let's Let's have me here, right, in the corner. I can make me a little bit smaller, right? Can I? Can I? No? Oh, yeah. Let me try to make me smaller. Uh, 
Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> Absolutely. I am so professional. Okay. So, we are here. Alright. So, let me... What I'm going to do. I have these resistors and long lead long leg of a lead to pin two three four five to pin digital pin right we need a digital pin right to the digital pins okay so digital means d analog means a right so long leg we are going to have here right digital one but um, I do not have enough. Okay. The thing is that we will do it here, right? So we will we will do this. So this one is going to be first led, right? And we will actually we will do this one, right? I think so. So led one. This is long leg that is going to be connected to the pin, right? And from here, we will we will go back to the to the uh, ground. So from this, okay. I hope I remember something. I hope this thing will not be will not explode. If it will explode, promise me you will call firefighters, right? Okay, then we have this one guy, okay, okay, then we have this one guy, all right, and then we have this one guy, so, oh, I didn't, didn't remember, okay, long leg there, Long leg would be on this side, short leg would be on this side, right? <laughs> Again, <laughs> long leg would be on this side, short leg is going to be on this side, right? So then I'm going to set up this one, right? And I will use my wonderful pins, my wonderful resistors, right? I will connect it to the correct pins. So, for example, here and to minus, right? Then, um, where is my, s okay, this one, right? Yeah, this is the idea, right? I need to focus how I am working. I mean, I should always look at my uh, camera to understand that I can see everything so and one more is here right everything to minus and we are going to send minus to the ground and right now we need four cables okay let's try to pick the same color so we need green one we need red one we need blue one and we need Right, and we need one more yellow one. I do not have yellow, I have orange. So we will we will use orange. Right, definitely I need to locate my camera. <laughs> so digital digital pins two, three, four. Okay. So digital pin okay ground digital pin two is going here to the ye to yellow, right? Right, then we have red. And red is going to be digital pin 3. Then we have blue. Okay. Okay, okay. Okay, so compact. Everything is so compact, right? Digital pin 3. Wonderful, and right now digital pin 4. Wait, 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 is it... Okay, yeah, this is correct, but maybe maybe to make it more visual, I can do that thing. I can place it near here. So, I mean, I will not 
connect wire to the each closest uh, hole i mean connection right i will i will connect like this right so this is blue and right now it is the last one is a green so let's try to connect i have here my wonderful usb hub and we can do that thing we can connect or okay we have we have some sort of signal right so um, and let's check what do we have here all right so um let me switch back um i i think i can have this one yeah maybe we can we can keep it maybe oh no we can so let's do this that we can see screen my screen right so um let's go to their um here right and let's just start two three okay let's just start will that work okay configure project okay oh no 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 Okay, looks like we compiled it, right? And right now let's send it. Ew, I hope that will not, that is not going to be explode. I hope so. And let me switch to another screen. Um, okay, okay. And something, something happened? No, 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 it's not working. <laughs> Maybe I need to reset this thing. No, this is not working. And this is interesting. Why it's not working? Available. Okay, terminal. I'm trying to remember. Like I'm trying to understand how it's... Okay, but... So this is serial monitor. But I need to just upload my firmware, right? To Atmega. Why you cannot see this? Okay. Let me try again. Okay. And connect okay oh okay let's update so this is okay but like auto and usb serial hmm. auto bluetooth why it's not here it's Previously, it was very, it was very simple. Hmm. Interesting. Programmer is not responding. Okay, but like, if I try to find custom. Okay. Auto. Maybe USB serial. I don't know. Maybe that thing. I don't know. <clears throat> Why it's not connected? Okay. Oh, environment nano, okay, and can we have here auto, and if I run it, will that work? It's not responding, but it is here, right? This thing is here, it is working.
can it be some problem with with USB hub? No. Hmm. Let's go back to my. Okay. Oh, I forgot to switch to screen. You see, I have I have such kind of errors, right? Mm, not configured. Maybe we can try to configure. Okay. How I can configure it? Maybe I need to go to the settings at Mega. Mm -hmm. So platform IO open. Okay. Uh, projects. This tester configure. Um, Arduino. Arduino, no, no, but but this is correct. Okay, okay. What if I check different one? Nana, no. So platform board. Okay, let's try this one. Will that work? Okay, this is just compiled and right now we are going, we are trying to upload the software, right? No, it's not working. Okay. Can it be our, this one? I'm, I'm not sure, but let's, let's try. Oh, I didn't, I didn't change. Okay. So new and we will save it right and then we will delete this one and start uploading okay Ooh. so you see the problem was that i i just had to select different ones so again two eight no no so uh i had i selected this one at mega nano at mega three to eight but i i should select this one okay never mind i didn't know that so and of course oh you're waiting sorry 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 you're waiting for this you can see wonderful right okay right now let's try to do impossible thing we will try to have everything wonderful me and of course um the project oh everything is little bit uh wobbling right okay let's go here and just uh have a function that is going to to set okay so what do i need i need functions function okay uh function of course let's see this is not swift Avoid uh, set melody, melody, and right now, what do I need? I suppose it is going to be int pin a, int pin pin b, int pin c. Actually, it is not going to be. Mm. Let's do with char, char because we just need one bit, oh, one bit, right? No, one. <laughs> we need, we need something smaller than int. We need char. Int is thirty-two bits or sixty-four bits. Correct me if I'm wrong. I mean, yeah, I forgot a lot of the things. I learned this in the university. But we need shorter. Maybe we will we will make optimization even more, right? And pin D, right? And what we are going to do here? We will do. I have some messages. Okay, not not right now. So and we will make this thing. Actually, what is 
What is hi? Can you show me? Hi. Okay. It's also int. Um, I do not need int. I mean, we, we want to be smart, right? So, and we will do this. Alright. Oh. Pin A. Pin A value. And we will add everywhere this right pin a pin b pin c pin d right so we are trying to make our our wonderful code better right because we are engineers and we want to have good solution right probably we can we can send all of this in a one in a one uh, char actually so yeah let's try to to run it and see what would happen oh i didn't didn't change it right so let's remove it here and we will oh no 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 too much removing right set melody and we will have um, actually how it was high and low right okay melody high let's make all high 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 and high Come on. <laughs> okay, let's try right now. Will we have all of this working together at the same time? Let's check. No, 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 we have an error. We have an error. Set melody. I guess because it's not defined. Okay, but but <sighs> what about right now? Okay. Okay. Wonderful. So Oh, all of them are working, right? We have what we wanted. And right now, what do we need? We wanna define these melodies. So um, let me copy all of these. So, um, and let's try to, to make it better. How we can make it better, right? We wanna have a name, right? Name for each melody. Um, hmm. Let me try to see, think about it in the next video because we are already out of time regularly. I am recording just one hour, but that's what I wanted actually. So probably next time what we will do. We will do the same very slow, like onboarding. We will just meet in the evening and talk about programming, this stuff. You can also try the same. I will publish this code somewhere. I mean, somewhere in in the GitHub, of course. So, and we will talk about that. So, in the next video, I want to have button, and I want to want to click on button. I want to change these values, and also I'm thinking about um, about changing this because we can just use one value, right? We can use just one value uh, in in a char. We have eight uh, pins, eight bits, <laughs> eight pins, eight bits, right? But we need just one uh, one bit. We need oh no no no. We need four bits, right? Let me check actually. Uh, uh, do we have? Do we have eight? bits in in char type yeah 
Yes. Okay. So in the mo okay. Eight beats, right? But we just need four beats, right? And this is like idea how we can make our our code smaller. So yes, you have like a lot of memory on like on the laptop. You have a billion of possibilities, right? Like near. You cannot spend so much uh, memory, but when we talk about Arduino and like memory consumption and so on, we are trying, we were, we are trying to make our code more um, more powerful, that can uh, work faster and use less memory, and all of this will help us to use less uh, battery and so on. So. On the Arduino, I'm trying to think about like optimizations, like hardware, because this will help us to, to optimize, right? This is like a real programming when you when you try to think not only about your code, you also will think about optimization. But I'm thinking to make this code pr uh, prettier, right? Since we have C++, we maybe have a structure and so on, right? Like we can define melodies with with a char, right? And yeah, and that's it. I mean, we. I don't wanna. I don't wanna have a code that looks like C++. I mean, I. I. I wanna have a API. I wanna have. A, a, let me switch back to myself, right? Because we're finishing, and I also can disable this. Turn this off. So I. I wanna have a code that looks like something between C++ and Swift, right? You that you can easily read it and understand it, because regularly, as I correctly remember, maybe right now C++ is different, but it's regularly not so easy to read, right? And uh, I, I. I wanna solve this problem with you. We will try to do this. I don't know. Will will it be okay? Will it? Uh, will I fail there or not? But we will discuss it in the next video. Maybe it will be in, even in this in, pff, even in this week. Okay. So I hope you can get something something interesting from this video. So tell me about the format, right? Like what was comfortable, what was uncomfortable. Like, like you understand, because I'm learning. I'm learning lots of things in parallel. I'm learning Arduino. I'm learning like uh, video production. I'm learning how to organize this session that you can see, I can see, everyone can see uh, what's, what's happened here. So yeah, that's it. Uh, write your feedback like anywhere where you want. So have a wonderful rest of the week. Or if you are looking at this video on a weekend, have a wonderful weekend, right? And see you in the next video. Thank you very much. See you later. Bye.